Hello, I'm Dina Titus, your representative from Nevada's 1st Congressional District. Today is the 20th of April, or as you may know it, 420, a date that often sparks the celebration of marijuana through the lens of American counterculture and folklore. But we shouldn't just think of today in terms of lava lamps and day glow posters. Marijuana can also help people suffering from PTSD, epilepsy, and cancer. So today is a reminder of how much work must be done to ensure that we lay a strong foundation for the future of the medical marijuana industry. We must continue to find a balance where patients get the treatments they need, health care competition grows, and the small business community prospers. In a few short years, Nevada has enacted regulations for the growth and sale of medical marijuana. Las Vegas' first dispensaries are now open for business and residents can receive medical cards after approval by a doctor. So while Nevada is up and running, there is a real gap between what's happening at home and what's happening in Washington. And that's why I'm working to address concerns about banking, research, and safe access in the marijuana industry. With legislation and other congressional efforts, I've helped ensure that the Justice Department won't target patients and the legal medical marijuana industry. I have called on the VA to change its policy so veterans and their doctors can talk about medical marijuana as a potential treatment. And last week, I joined a bipartisan group requesting the government remove barriers for federal marijuana research. I'm also supporting legislation to ensure that the marijuana businesses have access to banking services. These are just a few of the steps that can go a long way. So stand with me and tell Congress, join the majority of states, and pass laws that will help this industry grow. Puff, puff, pass those bills. Thank you.